to our Arab Socialist Republic in rogue state. Now, one thing about a socialist republic is that not very much money. Since we're paying for so many of these social programs, it's going to take us a while to actually build up our economy again. However, our overall popularity is probably as high as it's ever been, 86%. We are slowly losing respect with the liberals and the fundamentalists. Let's go ahead and end our turn and see what happens. A foreign hacker has obtained classified documents detailing the political prisoners we hold in secret isolation and is threatening to release the information to the press if we do not provide with 50 million uh so we have to buy a silence this is going to be 50 million we're going to lose money so i'm going to have to see if we just let him release it um the hackers inform the press about our secret political prisons we have tried our best to press the articles in the state on press but unfortunately human rights groups in western media are devoting a lot of attention to this wow that's bad so we're going to lose respect to the liberals probably the un and the u.s too we may have to go to war with the u.s who knows we're actually meeting with the minister today so this should be interesting let's see if it's productive Thank you for seeing me, Ambassador. It is my pleasure. Tell me, how are you enjoying our country? I have always been passionate about... Well, for me... You are too kind. Thank you, you're... All right, that's it. We can go ahead and end the conversation. We could always go anti-American, and one thing I think that they should do in this game is add another, like, a, sort of a, uh, a, maybe a Russia or a China, another group that you can work with. Let's take a look here. Basenji citizens are more patriotic. Okay, so, she wants me to improve Kalsharan Basenji relations. And actually, um, basically, a, doing what a minister wants can really help. So I'm actually going to call Kalsharan and hope that they share our socialistic ideals, although they may be complete fundamentalists. So we're going to call Kalsharan. And here we go. Ignores! You bastard! Well, that's not very nice. We're gonna go ahead and end the turn here, guys. Next turn, we should be able to afford something. Fundamentalist clerics are calling upon the government to prohibit luxury goods. Um, I think we want to agree to their request. We'll lose some respect to the capitalists, but we desperately need to gain respect to the fundamentalists. They are not liking us, whereas the capitalists are slightly okay with us. Okay. Fundamentalist to 94%? Are you crazy, lady? We can't possibly do that. Well, let's at least try to build some infrastructure here. Okay, we don't have any military of any, well, to speak of, really, but we desperately need more and more approval, uh, money, etc. And I think money is going to be the big issue here. Hmm, now we're going to get a lot of patriot and liberal approval here. This is really good. But what about money? What about making cash? Uh, advanced national interest through cooperation with like-minded states unlocks new county country specific regions I'd really like to do that. So I'm gonna have to go with foreign service It's not something that we can prioritize necessarily, but we don't have much of a choice Well-known American fast food chain that wants to open up its first franchise in the capital uh, We could allow them to conduct conduct business and gain a lot of money uh, But this would be against our socialist principles. So I'm gonna have to say No Yeah going to have to say forbid the corruption of our youth. This is going to make a lot of people upset, but like I said, I'm going to try to play these governments exactly like they should be played to see how they work in a Middle Eastern setting. So we're going to have to just, we're going to have to make less money and, and do it that way. That's the way it's going to have to be. Uh, let me see if we can get the Americans on the line. We need some of that American taxpayer money very, very soon. Go ahead and end their turn. One good thing about the socialist let's play, we can go quite quickly. Educators are proposing that English be taught alongside our native language in elementary school. Um, I'm going to go ahead and allow. And number one, not just because I want to get happy, good with the U.S., but I think every student should be bilingual. So I think that's a, that's a good thing. All right, here we go. Give me money, American money. I don't care. If we need your American money to build a socialist paradise, that's what we'll do. Thank you for seeing me. It is my pleasure. Okay, wow. A lot of different things we could do here. Let's go ahead and exchange pleasantries. How are you enjoying our country? I have always been passionate about Basenji and its people. I am very happy to be posted there. Well, for me, it is always a delight seeing you, Ambassador. The highlight of my day, even. Glorious. Okay, let's go ahead and ask him about, uh, maybe, love the President of the United States in our glorious country? Our long-standing friendship. I would love to receive the President of the United States in our glorious country. I will happily convey you awesome. to the Secretary of State. Beautiful. Now let's see if we can get some money. Ambassador. Foreign aid. Nice! 75 million! <laughs> this is what I'm talking about, guys. In the Basenji economy. It's just taxpayer money, after all. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. Now give me money. Um, also, a military partnership. You know what? We're socialists. 
But then again, Given our military is military. We would like to propose a military partnership with the United States. A military partnership? Yes! Beautiful, guys. We have military units. A socialist state receiving uh, U.S. backing. Why, there hasn't been a state like this since Cambodia under the Khmer Rouge. Um, but here we go. We're not going to be as nasty as them. We're actually going to be benevolent socialists. So uh, hopefully this will work out for the best. 43 million. We've got a lot coming next turn. Let's hope this is all for the best. All right. There is a small but significant number of people living in urban areas who refuse to vaccinate their children. Come on. No way. Um, I'm going to actually just say parents should decide what's best just to get the uh, liberals a little happier with me. Maybe we'll have a terrible epidemic in the country, but what can we do? Uh, your agreement to export electronics to Sanya has expired. Agreement to export culture to Sanya has expired. Okay. I didn't ignore her request. The fundamentalists like me. Oh, you evil woman. All right, she's not going to be very happy with me right now. So we're going to go ahead and once again start a new agreement. So, oh, I see. We didn't get ha we didn't get good with Kalshar. I think that's why she's upset. So let's sell these goods to Sanya once again. Thank you for taking. Are you interested? Certainly. Six million. That's terrible. You know what? I'm not going to accept. Uh, let's just discuss issues and see if we can uh, get them on our side. Spiritual leadership is important, but we must also accept that literal interpretations of the always do not make sense in this day and age. Spiritual leadership is important, but we must also accept that literal in We believe that theology is better than Good. The Good. Um We would like to deepen the long standing cooperation that exists between our two nations. The potential, of course, always exists. Good. Grow closer. Beautiful. Okay, so let's discuss trade now, and let's see if they I will give us a little more. Six million still. So we're going to wait a turn. We're going to bide our time. Um, and while we're doing that, we will, of course, invest in Basenji itself. Let's go to the build infrastructure screen. And I think we're going to have to do something about uh, social programs or the military, really. We need to get a military to redeploy new fronts at a shorter space of time. Then again, I think the most important thing for our socialist economy is going to be to boost these social programs. Let's get some liberal approval here with some education grants. Yes, baby. That's what I'm talking about. And now for our money, we're going to go ahead and do a regional summit. Get ten, plus 10 to all our neighbors' relations, guys. And this way, when we sell things to them the next turn, we might be able to make a little bit of money. So let's go ahead and end the turn. An awe-inspiring rare seahorse was discovered in a reef very close to a seaport under construction. Environmentalists are calling for you to put a hold on further construction in light of the discovery. N halt all construction and dedicate the reef as a national wildlife preserve. Uh, the patriots would like this so would the liberals of the capitalists would hate it. Or we could accelerate production of the seaport before the issue gains any traction in the media. And once again, I am trying to be socialist, but even a socialist can be corrupted. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and do this. Uh, gain some respect to the capitalists and make some money on the side. Here we go. The arrival of Air Force One this weekend marks the first ever visit of the President of the United States to the beloved People's Republic of Basenji. May it endure for 10,000 years. On his visit, President Vericella will be escorted by the glorious leader through the traditional markets of Hama and the Eternity Garden in Majimara. It is anticipated they will also stop the Revolutionary Memorial to pay tribute to the fallen martyrs in the Great Patriotic Revolution. The Great Patriotic Revolution remains a sensitive issue for American Basenji relations due to the historical support that the United States provided to the late King Salman. However, the mood is anticipated, uh, anticipated to be cordial. President Vericella remarked to the American media that the United States and Basenji have a very strong relationship. Wow, so actually I'm getting respect from the capitalists now, but we've got to call um, the Sanyis and uh, sell them these plastics. Thank you for taking my call. Two, he doesn't seem to be breathing, so the other hunter pulls out his cell phone and calls emergency services. He cries out to the operator, My friend is dead, what can I do? The operator says, Calm down, I can help. First, let's make sure he's dead. There is silence, then a gunshot is heard. Back on the phone, the hunter says, okay, now what? Jeez, <laughs> that's a good one. I guess he doesn't have much of a sense of humor. Okay, let's discuss trade. Are you interested in negotiating a trade agreement where we sell you Basenji electronics? Certainly. Still six million. We're going to have to accept it. And it's 100% of the market rate. Um... 
Are you interested in negotiating a trade agreement? They really just have better resources than we do. As you can see, their resources are actually much more valuable. Let's do it. 13 million. That's what I'm talking about. Now, that can keep us afloat for a turn or two, guys. We're going to end our call. Goodbye. Okay, beautiful. Um, at this point, we're going to just have to wait for that money to start rolling in. Loyal ministers' bodies are dredged from a river. The police have no suspects. Oh, my goodness. So we've got to go ahead and get a new communications minister who's going to be a capitalist. Maybe this was an assassination plot by the capitalists. We have to remain steadfast. Okay, working conditions in Basenji are very poor. Tell me something I don't know. Go ahead and end the turn here. The United Human Rights Council has dropped a highly critical report of Basenji. How dare they? We're going to say criticize the biased report. The UN is just trying to make our wonderful socialist paradise look bad by attacking our people. This is ridiculous, and we won't stand for it. Not for a second. Next turn, we can get another wonderful um, actual bit of uh, legislation passed. And as you can send here, see here, the Basenji Intelligence Authority has obtained credible evidence that anti-Western terrorists have set up training camps in the remote deserts of Basenji. We could offer them financial aid and armaments, but that would be too... They don't want to give them money. Ask the U.S. to provide uh, military assistance or ignore their activities as they don't concern your people. I want to do this so bad. We're going to do it, guys. We're going to offer them financial aid and armaments to the terrorists. Um, in this case, it's to get the fundamentalists on our side and because we want to fight against the capitalist U.S. Remember, sometimes you have to work with your enemy to fight against him. And that's what's happening here. Let's go ahead and get some infrastructure up. And I think we might want to start working on the military or maybe just a money-making venture uh, would be a good idea. A cartel. Your domestically produced goods will receive a massive one-time boost in value. Huh. I like that. I also like the global shipping giant. What well, can we get that? 50? Ah, I see. What about... Advanced Diagnostics Hospital. Or the sweatshop. Let's go for the sweatshop. I don't know why I can't grab the sweatshop. Is it because of this? The 5? Ah, this might be the issue. Huh. We need to wait one more turn. That is a bit strange. <clears throat> Prominent Council has put forward a proposal to prohibit the foreign adoption of Basenji children. Um, we're going to continue to permit foreign adoption. Come on. This is crazy. Now let's see if we can purchase something. If not, we may have a game bug. That'd be unfortunate, wouldn't it? Um, let's jump down here. I don't think I want to go for the cartel. Global shipping giant. There we go. Yes. And we get uh, appro more approval when our capitalist respect is, is high. I do believe it's high enough to get that economic boost. Let's take a look at our treasury and commodity data and also at our policies and see what the capitalists think of us. Um, so I might actually have to lower trade a little bit because that's one way to immediately get people to like you. Let's see. Yes, we are getting that boost. But as you can see, we're losing a lot of respect with the liberals um, and losing a lot of respect with the fundamentalists. Let's see what we can do to gain respect with the liberals. Let's see if we can lower the police just a little bit. It's going to gain... No, it's not going to give us any respect with them. What if we allow trade unions? Of course we should. We are socialists. Um, this is the way to go. Yep, we're going to allow trade unions. Um, and um, maybe we'll get rid of the death penalty. Okay, I think this is the way to go. So as you can see here, we're going to lose respect with our capitalist friends, um, or excuse me, with our patriot friends, but they already like us so much. We want to gain respect with the liberals. So there we go. We will end our turn, and I think we've made the right decision. Definitely. Here we go. Karifia employment has climbed to as high as 15, unemployment, excuse me, has climbed to as high as 15% and is dragging down the rest of your nation's economy. Now, the Karifi are a small minority group within Basenji. Uh, the people are looking to the government to provide a plan to address the crisis. All right, we could lower the corporate tax rate. This would obviously get us GDP bonus. The liberals would hate us more. The capitalists would love us. Or we could order our trade commissioners to prioritize the promotion of career fee exports or provide incentives for education and high demand fields. I'm going to order my trade commissioners to prioritize the promotion of Karifi experts among all others. We cannot allow uh, a minority to be offended in the glorious Republic of Asenji. This is just not acceptable. So there we go, 24 million a turn, and so far we are doing exceptionally well. 86% approval. Um, let's go ahead and continue. Okay. 
Minister of Justice reports that illicit opium exports from Basenji fundamentalists have risen threefold throughout our land borders. Well, let's go ahead and ensure our own narcotic smugglers are not undercut. <laughs> that's what I'm thinking. Um, I'm thinking that's the important thing. And here we go. The great speech to the people of Basenji. If we can get this down right, guys, this will so far be our most successful playthrough uh, with our glorious Arab Socialist Republic, the Baathist Republic, of course. As we are ushering in a new era in the history of our homeland. I wish to address you first, as you are the owners of this blessed land, its defenders, the builders of its prosperity, and the architects of its future. The American watermongers realize they cannot... Yeah, straight up calling out the U.S. The world ...and are thinking twice about crossing the great nation of Basenji. Yes! The new branch of the police of Basenji will be tasked with... The now, the only reason I said that was to get the speech bonus up. We gotta say what we gotta say, and we have to pander to the fundamentalists right now. We're sort of socialist fundamentalists, sort of a mix between the two. And this is Arab socialism, um, very similar to Baathism. We're not going to deregulate our financial institutions, but we must say what makes the people happy. ...in order to increase their competitiveness in the global market. Remember, this is all just fluff. Finally, it is with a full heart that I say to you all. Our people will put their steadfastness into the works of peace and human culture. This is our desire. We hope for it, and we believe in it. Come on, get to that green, or at least the orange. Not bad, guys. So we actually got some respect from the speech. Uh, and this should certainly help us. Wow, our people adore us. Even the liberals love us. Uh, so this is going very, very well. And right now, our Arab Socialist Republic is just doing extremely well, guys. You know, lack of compassionate programs. I think we can go ahead and possibly build uh, some health care for the people. Let's look into that. The Diagnostics Hospital, of course. Anyway, guys, I hope you are liking this particular Let's Play. If you are, make sure to hit that like button. I try to make these videos a little longer than my other ones uh, because I know you guys enjoy watching them. So uh, just make sure to hit that like button and, and tell me if you like the longer videos. Thank you so much, guys. Glory to Basenji. And let's go ahead and win this game once and for all. Take care, my friends.